Oh wow, what a treat. These delicate little beauties are western oak ferns. When it comes to ferns here in Cascadia, there really are some of the most spectacular ones around. Western oak ferns are some of the coolest ferns we have here in Cascadia. You know, one of my favorites, definitely somewhere in the top three. They grow really well in wet to moist environments, often depressions on the forest floor where there's a lot of water buildup or alongside streams or even rocky clearings covered in moss where they grow in colonies like this of solitary fronds. Their stipes are really thin and glossy, splitting off into threes, with each leaf cluster being very triangular shaped and the upper two significantly smaller than the bottom one. Their leaves are really thin and papery, repel water very easily, deeply lobed and rounded, with sori sprinkled all on the underside. I mean, they really are pretty gorgeous ferns. Now, western oak fern kind of resemble another fern here in Cascadia, western maidenhair fern, and that they're both really thin, delicate, hairless ferns growing in a similar environment, both gorgeous, um, but there are a few key differences. For example, oak ferns tend to grow about half as high as maidenhair ferns, and while they both grow in colonies on thin, glossy stipes, Western maidenhair ferns tend to have more of a purplish black hue to their stipes, uh, branching off into twos, whereas oak ferns like this are kind of more greenish brown, branching off into three. Their leaves also have a similar construction, although maidenhair ferns tend to have more right angle blunted edges, whereas oak ferns are really round, um, very distinguishable leaf pattern. Oh, hey, gorgeous. Now, oak ferns grow in large colonies that form a ground cover of this really cool, intricate, flowing, kind of woven blanket of all these different hues of green. It's really quite spectacular. They're not related in any way to oak trees, nor do they even grow near oak trees. In fact, the genus gets its name from a species out east that kind of resembles a polypod that does grow in oak trees in England. It's, it's a weird naming thing. I like to think that they're called oak ferns because their heavily lobed leaves kind of resemble those of an oak tree. Ah, gorgeous little western oak ferns. And even though you spell it O-A-K, these things sure are A-OK -okay by me. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. Oh, gall dang, what a beauty. If you're enjoying these videos, feel free to subscribe to my channel below or just keep watching to keep learning because the more you know, the more fun you're gonna have next time you're outside in nature, enjoying it. Sure is rad out here. There's just, there's so much green, you know? I've never seen this much green before.